hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel how are you all doing i hope you all are great so guys in today's video i will be showing you how i make my own aloe vera oil to use on my hair and my daughter's hair for fast hair growth so if you are interested to know how i make it please stay tuned as we start so guys this is the aloe vera i will be using so it's already washed and clean so i will just be chopping it i will cut it into three just to remove the edges the reason of this is that there is some gelatin inside that thing is poisonous it's not good at all on on your hair on your skin as well so what i do i will just cut it this way and place then leave them inside water for some one hour or some minutes and make sure that the yellow tin is washed out then after then i will just use my my kitchen paper my kitchen paper to dry to dry the water off because i don't want the 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 oil to to have any contact with water so i will dry it off this way i will be leaving the benefit of aloe vera here in the screen so you can know that aloe vera has a bed a very great benefit so guys enjoy watching the video as we proceed So after drying the aloe vera, I'm going to be shopping it little by little inside a blended cup. So shopping it this way, just little like this inside the blended cup. I have already shopped them. Now we'll proceed to move with ginger. Many of us know the great benefit that ginger has. So I do the same thing and I wash it and I will also shop it like that both the skin as well because the skin also has a great benefit as well i will be leaving also the benefit of ginger here in the screen so keep watching guys so guys the oil i will be using is extra virgin olive oil and i will also be putting the benefit here on the screen So the both ingredients is now ready to blend. Make sure you blend and blend it smoothly. Then pour it into your pot and put it on lower heat. Let this cook for 20 to 15 minutes so that the oil will cook and mix with the olive oil to bring the great benefit. As you can see, our oil is already cooked. So we are going to be leaving it to cook down Put on the stove and let it cool down. Now that it has cooled down, we will transfer it into a clean and a neat bottle. Like this very one you are seeing here. So, I will just be transferring it like this. So, I will transfer both all of them together and i will leave it to sit for two to three hours before taking the oil out leave this to sit for uh, two to three hours so that it can release all the benefits now let me show you how i apply this on my daughter's hair so this is the oil here. This oil can last you for years. Can last you for two years without 
preservative this oil is very safe to use and we help boost boost the hair growth of your hair growth or your child's hair growth so as you can see my daughter hair is very dry i will take the the rubber band off then let me show you how i apply it session by session so always work with session to avoid breaking of hair so i will cut the session i'm going to be working with and pack the rest of the hair up so now the next you will do before applying the oil is i'm going to take the trees down so then i will use my finger to detangle the hair a little bit then you will need water water is a great solution to our type of hair especially natural hair like this so our fussy hair is too thick so for the oil to be mixed with to work very well on the hair using the oil hello it's not to, it's not going to be combined or absorbed to the hair strands so water is going that is the the water job on that so that was the reason i sprayed the i spray water first before applying the oil to make the boat to make the oil absorb into the into the hair so it's just like a balloon when you place a balloon it will not stay in a place it's just like that when you put your oil it's on your hair just like that it's not going to stay it's going to stay on top like that it's not going to be absorbed onto the hair strands so water will do that job for you so after then i will just apply the oil give the scalp a massage then use my hand to detangle the hair gently I will make sure the hair is gently detangled and water is also a great a great solution to detangle your hair or your child's hair as you can see it is full detangle now there is no breakage there is no sharing of hair so after then i will just twist the hair back just like this after twisting i will leave it and move over to the next session then i will have to finish all the hair that way then i will come back to show you how far i have gone twisting the hair this way so guys before you forget when you take your child's braid down please always 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 treat their hair with prepare their hair with oil or or any other natural hair remedy that you can lay your hands to before you move to another braid or twisting their hair so that will give their hair strength and her voice the hair to be weak to lead to sharing of hair or break hair. so please keep this in mind and it's very important so i will not forget to give to thanks all my subscribers and all my whole and new subscriber i say may god bless you i really really appreciate you guys for always supporting my channel may god bless you thank you so much and if you are also a new comer to my or this is the first time seeing my channel or watching my video you are very welcome may god bless you for tuning in thank you and i appreciate if you're also a returning subscriber thank you for coming back and god bless you please don't forget to press the subscribing button and the notification bell doing so you will be notified anytime i upload a new video so guys after set and done 
I will continue massaging a Skype like two to three minutes before packing her hair up. Then I will just pack her hair up with this uh, elastic rubber. Then I'm going to be, what I will do next is just to cover the hair with a, a plastic rubber to leave the hair to work for one, 45 minutes to one hour is enough. Then I wash the hair off. Thank you all so much for watching. See you on my next video. Bye.